Hi, Peer students. My name is Mario, and I'm one of the full-time librarians at the Pierce Library. In this research training for History 11, I'm going to be covering a few databases to help you with your research assignment. So this is just an introductory video to the research tutorial. Starting in the library's website, I want to show you this guide. If you click on Subject Guides, you're going to open up all the library guides that librarians have created. And we have one for the discipline of history. So if you scroll a bit in alphabetical order and click on history, that should open it up. So once you get to this page, we try to put everything that would be useful for students who are conducting historical research. And the tab that's probably the most exciting is the one that reads databases and articles. So here are all the databases that the library pays for that specialize on historical research. And if we go back to the library's homepage, you can also look at those databases by clicking on databases A through Z. And that will show you all of our databases that we subscribe to which you have access to even off campus with your student ID number and your month and date of birth. So once you get to this full list, you probably only want to look at the his history ones. So if you click on all subjects and scroll down that drop down menu for the tag history, this list will sort for the same databases that specialize on historical research. And in this training, I'm going to be covering the one called Gale in Context for U.S. History, and another one called Academic Search Complete. And in addition to those two databases, I'm also going to be talking briefly about this great database called Digital Public Library of America. And if you go to our history guide, I have hyperlinked that website under the tab that reads Primary Sources. And there's going to be a, a video for this particular website, too. And as this is loading up, remember that you can always ask the librarians for help. We are still working online and we would love to help you with your research. So you can always go to the library's homepage and there's a chat box underneath where you can literally start chatting with a real librarian 24 7 any time of the day any day of the week it's a nationwide service where a lot of academic librarians contribute their time so just to show you that chat box this is how you can start chatting with the librarian and sometimes on the right bottom corner this chat box will pop up it's it's almost the same thing and then in terms of primary sources, not that my page has loaded up, in the history guide, this is where we would be opening up that special website. Anyways, I hope you have fun with this research assignment and let's go watch the other videos.